Hello everyone, today I'm going to share with you how to create a button and then when you click uh, create a button uh, inside Vision Pro and you, after you click it, you, you will see a 3D model show up. Okay, so today is just a very simple showcase to show how you can implement a simple code on Apple's website and then later on uh, create a customized kind of like a uh, interaction okay so let's start so what we will show you today is you click this one and you will see wow there's a 3d model shows up okay so this um, this interaction uh, we are going to uh, uh, show you okay so um, today I will cover the entire reality kit content simply by kind of inputting a 3d model and also I will share with you how to kind of uh, add some code and make everything works okay so let's start with another scene okay so just turn it off okay so this one later on I will insert a bunch of code here and then um, yeah I will also like walk you through how to uh, do everything okay so when I go to um, the beta Xcode then I create the entire new file I will go to vision OS and click add click next add a 3d button demo 2 okay so next okay so I want to put inside okay cool demo to okay create okay so once you create a file you can see like uh, in content there are a bunch of new things here right um, and if you go here there are a bunch of things so it means that um, for for this it adds up a lot of different code for example when you toggle uh, the immersive space it will show the entire more like a VR space so you can put all your like a uh, um, yeah so it's it's more like the entire scene will go black so uh, what we want to do is since we just want to since I today I just want to share with you like a simple concept of it so uh, let's just clean up clean it up and uh, this one what I will do is delete all the code because if you um, add a bunch of code it will just show the dark mode after you press the button so that's delete those uh, modifier and then this one since we are not doing any toggle so we don't need any state and as for environment we only need the open uh, immersive space and dismiss immersive space we don't need to toggle back so we can take it out and as for v stack all we need is this one right uh, we don't really need um, uh, all the other things so pretty much we can take out all the stuff uh, uh, yeah we can take out a lot of stuff for example like inside here we can totally take it out uh, yeah, we can take out this. All we need to do, we, we to, we can do is we can have a kind of button here, and uh, or later on we can get a bunch of different uh, buttons. So uh, let's just take everything out. Yeah, same view. Uh, maybe something. Yeah, maybe that's kind of like uh, having some. Yeah, let's just clean it up. Yeah, let's just clean it up. And uh, this one, we can also uh, change this one. We can clean it up as well. Just keep it very simple. Uh, so this one, we can take it out. Uh, let's see. This one is this. This one is this. This one is this. Okay, so this one is extra, right? Let's take it out. Okay, so this one. An immersive view. Uh, we don't really need a lot of uh, other code so we can also like uh, uh, take everything out so uh, we can take all this out okay yeah 
just make sure it still works okay so uh, let's just clean out a lot of um, code so this one is just like a little little dot but later on we will add a bunch of um, things I like to put on this yeah just for the sake of easy to read okay cool okay so um, first one is that we need to um, this code allows us to this is the window view yeah we have window group and we have immersive space so uh, for the content content is that the goal the entire goal for us is to create a button so if you are very interested in how um, how to create this in this video on the uh, developer.apple.com uh, in this video it has reality composer pro uh, during this video you can see there are a lot of uh, snip code that allows uh, you to kind of create a different um, uh, kind of features for vision pro so uh, for men right this one this one actually uh, for, for can allows us to get into an immersive uh, space and also uh, for the button we need to add this uh, entire uh, code so we can uh, uh, kind of like it. so go here um, and copy the button for the content view scene okay so let's go here uh, go to content view so we can totally uh, yeah let's go here and button right uh, this one this one okay so this is it means that in this content view if I click this button and says open then uh, it will go to the uh, um, immersive space okay so let's just see if we can maybe we can just take this out oh yeah so yeah so because that is not really necessary let's just kind of remove it okay so what i did was i put a button right and it says open open to air to lens yeah, so open to airplanes also I can also add a V stack but I think today I just wanna uh, showcase like a really quick uh, button click and show 3d object that is my intention and later on we can dive into how can we uh, do a nice layout inside vision pro okay so this one and uh, for the immersive view uh, since we want to put uh, kind of like a airplane then that's diving so in packages if you open reality kit content you can see there's uh, a square and uh, there's like a, a kind of like a reality composer icon when you click it you can see two uh, 3d object and on the right top corner there's uh, a button called open in reality composer pro so when you click it you will see this and it's under the scene code immersive so either you delete those two and replace with something or we can create another new scene so I'm going to create another new scene code air air plane or airplane okay airplane so uh, after we create an airplane this will be the 3d model and under it it will be the assets uh, here it will shows like uh, uh, the entire uh, kind of um, parameters that you can change okay go to up right corner there's a plus button and that's scroll down those are uh, Apple's 3D assets so feel free to put anything you like so what we are going to do is we will insert toy by plan okay so let's click it 
double click it. So you will see this entire um, kind of like uh, the airplane will be placed nicely here. Okay, so what we we'll, what we will do is um, before I kind of put some um, parameters. So let's dive into. Let me see. Chichi. I think I didn't really put on anyway, so uh, let's kind of dive in um, 200, maybe 150. Uh, and for Z space, if we put minus, it will be in front of um, the audience. So we put like, because it's CM, so we put about uh, two meters, um, yeah, in front of the. Um, the audience so uh, in the position X we do zero so rotation I remember I did it 45 and also um, rotation I did it like a 20 or something okay so let's double click this so you will see uh, maybe minus 20 yes something going up is better Okay, so something like this might work. Okay, so yeah, maybe 130. So later on, we can totally uh, change the thing I will share with you. There's uh, in Xcode, whatever you put in reality kit content, you can modify the code just right on the Xcode I will share with you. Okay, so this is the same code air plan. And then that's kind of okay so we're just down with that so here if you kind of go down and see source so airplane if you click this this will be everything that we kind of manipulate for the, the stuff so if we go here content view content view uh, this for this um, oh, okay, so we probably need to do. Hmm. Uh, sometimes it has some bugs, so uh, we can go to product and we go to clean view folder. Yeah, because this is a beta version, so sometimes there's bugs. So you can go to product and start to yeah debug it. Yeah, okay. So it's still very unstable. So we have to just be patient. Okay, so uh, our goal is to change uh, the immersive view, uh, the name immersive to the name airplane. Uh, um, airplane, okay. E so we need to change the same name as the name on here so which means that content view we create a button and have an ID which means that we need to open the immersive view here this is the uh, this one so we want to open this one right and uh, this one will be uh, here okay so this one uh, this one reality view so this is the immersive view and this is the okay so we probably need to activate and if you want to preview the immersive view you need to add this extra code okay so you see I personally think it's probably too high so if you want to change it uh, remember we did some uh, some adjustment so this one uh, scale transform 1.3 right so this is the matter thing but we probably need to kind of make it a little bit lower. So if we do this and go back, hopefully a little bit lower, uh, go to airplane. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, we probably need to save it. Um, oh, scale. Oh, oh, interesting. Okay, so translate. Maybe uh, 1, maybe 0 0.5. Yeah, we can kind of uh, change the height, the the Y. Yeah, so this is kind of going down. Okay, so let's 
testing things out. Okay, so this one, our goal is click this button and this airplane will show up. Okay, so let's see whether we can. Let's debug again. Okay, let's click this. So, take some time. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, you will, you need to zoom in. You will see open two airplanes, right? And when you click, oh, it's very low, it's almost here. So maybe we bring it up, I would say, possibly 1.5. Okay, so yeah, so uh, we just have to keep adjusting uh, translate. Uh, I think translate is probably the one. 1 1.3. Yeah, I think 1.3 is a good one. Okay, let's close this and go to product, clean, uh, build folder, go here, and then click play button. Mm. Okay, so let's take a look. Takes a while. Okay, let's get in. Oh, okay, so we, we see this button. Yes, and it shows here. Yeah, yeah, so you can de definitely change the size, for example, like we can also open this if you are more visual person you can definitely go here and maybe let's change to five 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 make it bigger uh, and maybe make the position more closer yeah let's just save it yeah so yeah we can change either on the code or we can totally uh, change the thing okay clean build folder and let's click the play button Takes a while. Oh, oh. Okay. Hopefully, it's on the right place. Yes. Okay. So, this is uh, what we are doing today. And uh, if you wanna uh, look around, right? This will be good way to just browse around and see uh, the entire uh, scene like this like this like this yeah so okay thank you so much and uh, if you are interested in learning more uh, we have our hub called x reality academy so um in this video you should be able to find a link to join our hub so um, I will share the link inside video or some disc uh, inside the description of videos so yeah so just sign it and hopefully see you in actuality hub okay thank you and I will see you next time bye bye